Welcome back to NurseNet Numeracy, the free-to-use online maths tutorial course designed for nurses. In the last two lessons, we've looked extensively at administering a drug via a drip, and we've calculated the drip rate based on the known prescribed amount, the stock dose of the drug, and the total time the drip should be used to administer the prescribed volume of the drug to the patient. In this lesson, we're going to calculate the total length of time a drip should be administered if we know the drip rate. Now to do this, we need to calculate the total number of drops per milliliter multiplied by the volume of the fluid divided by the drip rate. So putting this into context, let's do an example. A patient is to be given 500 milliliters of a drug that is administered at 20 drops per milliliter with a drip rate of 25 drips per minute. How long will it take to administer the fluid? Well, we have drops per milliliter at 20, multiplied by the volume of the drug, which is 500 milliliters, giving us a total of 10,000 milliliters. 10,000 milliliters divided by the drip rate, which is 25, giving us the time in minutes of 400 minutes. If we convert this into hours and minutes, 400 divided by 60 is equal to 6 hours and 40 minutes. Okay, let's do another one together. A patient is to be given 650 milliliters of a drug that is administered at 20 drops per milliliter with a drip rate of 20 drips per minute. How long will it take to administer the fluid? Now, using our formula, we have 20 drops per milliliter multiplied by the 650 milliliter volume of fluid, which gives us 13,000 milliliters. 13,000 milliliters divided by the drip rate of 20 drops per minute gives us a total time in minutes of 650 minutes. To convert this into hours, divide 650 minutes by 60, giving us a total of 10 hours and 50 minutes. Okay, now try the calculate time to administer a fluid test on the NurseNet numeracy site. Remember, you can find lots more maths help for nurses at www.nursenet.uk or if you're looking for your next career move in nursing, do check out our jobs board.